Matthew 18, verses 3 to 4. And he said, Truly I tell you, unless you change and become like little children, you will never enter the kingdom of heaven. Therefore, whoever takes the lowly position of this child is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. As you know, this is a celebration this morning for all the children of our church. And sometimes I really hate saying children of our church because it's not children anymore. It's young men and they're growing up. But because we're all children of God, I guess I feel safe saying children, children of our church. <laughs> During the years we've been hearing, we hear passages from, quite often we hear passages from the book, The Places You Will Go. Well, I found a new book and I would like to read a little bit of the new book to you. It is called, I Wish You More. Just a few pages. I wish you more, give than take. I wish you more, we than me. I wish you more hugs than uggs. <laughs> I wish you more pause than fast forward. I wish you more treasures than pockets. And I wish all of this for you because you are everything that we could wish for and more. We're going to watch a video and we're going to listen and we're going to hear what these kids have been doing all year. It's been a wonderful year from what I've seen. And um, just thank everybody for being here. Thank the parents for bringing you. I would like to thank the praise band. I would like to thank everybody else who's helping set up out there for our wonderful party. And I would like to thank the parents for making sure that your kids got here and got to school every morning this year. So here we go. <laughs> well, <laughs> Hannah. Hannah earned the principal's honor roll all year. She loves to read and is one of the best readers in her class. And she complete, competed in the Gymnastics USA Olympics and earned a gold medal. I know it's wonderful to clap, but if we could hold our applause until the end, I'm going to bring all the kids up here and then you can clap for all of them at once. Thank you. Amelia, Hannah's sister, she also competed in the Olympics and got a gold award. It is her first year of dance and she performed on her, in her recital. She goes to big school, school. She goes to big kids school at Westbrook next year for VPK. How exciting! <laughs> That's okay. It's all right. Emmett. Emmett or was organi organized and ran a school-wide Mario Kart tournament. He hosted a school-wide racial show. He graduated from Kiva International. Okay, Kiva International School. And he completed the requirements for graduation under the confusion of evacuation and a challenging family separation. <laughs> Riley. Riley um, was a 2022 honors student and graduate of the William R. Boone High School Academy of Finance, where he worked as a student teller for additions financial credit union while attending high school. He's the captain of the Boone High School crew team where he qualified for Scholastic National Regatta in Camden, New Jersey on May 27th. Current Scholastic 2022 Florida State Champion for both men's doubles and men's pair events. Accepted to Drexel University in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania where he intends to study finance and join the rowing team. Wow. <laughs> Katie Cook. Katie Cook graduated from Windermere High School and she is heading to Tallahassee Community College, then Florida State. Wow. 
Sadie. Sadie completed her first grade ESE. She has successfully become much more verbal this year, and she loves telling stories. <laughs> and she likes jokes. Stella completed first grade, has mastered reading and everything else. She read all the Sunshine State books. <laughs> Erica, Erica pitched the championship game in Puerto Rico and won. She, she learned how to cook and she graduated from eighth grade. <laughs> Faith got her first job. She completed the second year of Varsity Girls Lacrosse as a starter, and she got her driver's license and her dream car, a Jeep. <laughs> and Parker, not only is it his birthday today, but he can also pedal the bike. He has made his first friends at school, and his speech has improved enough to command Alexa. <laughs> and has self-taught gymna self gymnastics with goals of learning how to do a split, back bends, and round offs, and succeeding. She learned how to boulder, and she's an all-A student this year. Brandon, is that a caterpillar? Oh, nice. <laughs> nice. Is he your friend? He's very cute. It's a tiger black belt. He has learned to read and write, and he continues to be the best at sharing and caring for siblings and others. <laughs> Shay has played the role of Augustus Gloop in the school play of Willy Wonka. He is the black belt elect and will test for a black belt in July, and his perfect scores on practice FSA. <laughs> Quinn, little baby Quinn. We think of her as a baby, but she's all grown up. <laughs> Quinn started preschool this year at Windermere Union Church. She has grown and learned so much since she started in August. She loves seeing her friends and playing on the playground. Our youngest also started dance class with her sister this year. She loves to twirl and dance to her own beat. <laughs> Quinn loves all things Mickey Mouse and spending time with her family. <laughs> Dax, Quinn's brother. We are so proud of our second grader. He has learned so much this year. His favorite subjects at school are math, Spanish, art, and PE. His interests outside of the school extend to world geography and robotics. In both the fall and the spring, Dax played his favorite sport, soccer. It's so fun to watch our little athlete improve his ball coordination, as well as work on his team building skills. Dax started playing piano this year. He can read notes. Yay! <laughs> and Tessa. Tessa is so excited about going into kindergarten in the fall. As most of you know, for the last three years, Tessa has attended a remediation program at Whispering Oaks Elementary for a significant speech delay, in addition to attending preschool at Windermere Union Church. To give some insight, three amazing speech and language experts work with our sweet tea for about three hours a day. We are ecstatic to report that after years of intervention, Tessa has improved so much that she has nearly lost her IEP. She will be starting kindergarten in the fall with very minimal intervention. As you can imagine, we are beyond thrilled. Way to go, sweet tea. Outside of school, Tessa loves to dance. We saw many of the dance moves while she played soccer this last spring. Soccer probably isn't her sport. <laughs> Ralph completed his first grade at Innovation Montessori. He dreams of becoming a businessman and growing a mustache. <laughs> he is working on his reading, he is learning how to swim strokes in swimming lessons, and he is mentoring his younger brother in swordsmanship and pirating swings. <laughs> George, looks like we have an angel, <laughs> started preschool at Windermere Union Preschool. He learned how to walk in a line, follow teacher commands, and interact with other children. He just started swimming lessons and he is working on his speech with the help of a speech therapist. <laughs> Katerina, in addition to winning the Bright Light Award today, <laughs> is a freshman at Dr. Phillips in visual and performing arts magnet, TV film and production program. 
She was awarded the Rising Star School Film Fest Festival. She was invited to join Orange County paid internship over the summer, shooting and live streaming county events. She has completed over 60 hours of volunteer hours, and she finished out the year with straight A's. <laughs> Lily Young. In the past year, she has been able to read Sweet Dreams, Pow Pow Fish, all by herself. <laughs> this, is the this is their baby. This is Perse Persephone. Thank you, Persephone. Persephone can say hi, so let's say it back. Hi, Persephone. <laughs> Reagan. Has almost straight A's through seventh grade. She is learning Japanese on her own with the help of a woman from Japan, and she made many new friends that she helps with whatever they might need. <laughs> Milena. Milena performed the school play One Dalmatians as Cruella de Mille. She, <laughs> she was selected to present her school at All County Chorus. She earned all A's this year and earned the highest GPA Achievement Award, and she completed elementary school and will be starting middle school in the fall. <laughs> Amelia has become quite expressive and loves to talk and cuddle. She enjoys coloring and puzzles and is excited to start playing. Oops. Sorry. Alex Jones. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex. I skipped a page here. Alex joined the Bay Lakes Chorus and found his voice as a singer. Alex recently ranked as a We Below's in Cub Scout and is advancing to the Arrow of Light this weekend. Alex started playing flag football this winter. He is eager to try tackle football at the end of this summer. <laughs> and now, Amelia. Amelia has become quite expressive and loves to talk and cuddle. She enjoys coloring and puzzles and is excited to start playing soccer. She's potty training and ready to move up to big girl with her up to big girl with her sister Tessa at Innovation Montessori. We are proud of her gentle kindness. <laughs> and Tessa, her sister, has become a ferocious reader. She enjoys taking art classes at the art room and piano lessons. We are proud that she's developed such a strong sense of self. So, all of you that are here that saw your video, come on up. Come on up and join me up here. Please. Eventually, people will get them. These are our graduating, graduating seniors, and they're going off to college. And we have a gift for their potty. Some of them are working, some of them could not be. Congratulations, Riley. face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. 